BEA fam, what's happening? Video today I wanted to share with you what I like to do throughout each day uh, to make myself feel better spiritually, mentally, and uh, and physically. Um, with that being said, I go to the gym and I'm also trying to study, read books, this and that for the mental aspect and the physical aspect. But now the spiritual aspect as well is meditation. So, But what I wanted to share with you today is a feel-good list. I want each of you to do me a favor and each morning or throughout each day sometime Write down a few things that you would like to have accomplished or completed by the end of that day. Not the next day. Not next week. That very day, guys. The, the beauty of this is that you're going to accomplish these tasks and you're going to feel accomplished by doing these, by completing these tasks. So I call it a feel-good list. An example, if you need to get three loads of laundry done before you go to sleep, get the three loads of laundry done. No excuses. If you need to go to the gym get to the gym. Write down all these things that will better yourself in a way or will just make you feel better throughout the day if accomplished, if completed. Start a feel-good list. It's very simple and it definitely works a lot, guys. I'm telling you. The simplest things like making your bed, doing your bed sheets, anything, guys. Anything that you need to get done that you feel you may be pro procrastinating or delaying, write it down. And make sure that before your head hits the pillow at night that you get these things done throughout the day. You'll feel completed, you'll feel a lot more confident, and you'll feel the self-discipline factor. That's what it is. It's a self-discipline factor. When you get into that groove, into that mode, you, you, when you're focused, you're going to flow, guys. I love that. If, I love no focus, no flow, right? So if you're focused, you're going to flow. Everything is going to work out. You're going to have a very productive day. I believe that pr productivity and positivity go hand in hand, guys. You know... If you're the more productive you are, the more positive you could be as well. So you're staying busy, also a good thing, but you're you're feeling good about accomplishing these things that you're that you said you would accomplish. So that's gonna take you a lot farther in life than you can imagine, guys. It starts small. Laundry, this, all, all these knickknack bullshit things that you don't want to do. It starts small, but it's going to grow into something bigger. Oh, you don't want to have to study for that test that you need in order to graduate college. Yeah, but now the self-discipline factor is going to kick in, and you're going to roll with it, and it's going to work. I promise you guys. Try it. The feel-good list. Another quick update I wanted to give you guys. I have been still doing the 52 new. Each day of the week throughout this year so far, I have tried something new. I've written it down in my notebook. Um, it's actually really, really, really damn awesome. Uh, I'm almost there. I got about two or three weeks left until I actually complete the whole damn thing. So it's going to be pretty emotional for me because I'm going to look back on January 1st and how far I've came from then. And uh, I've literally done, as of now, 49, 50 different things that were brand new that I've never done before, which is awesome. So with the new year coming in, I also want to suggest to you, try a 52 new. Very simple to do. One thing, one new thing each week. doesn't have to be anything extreme. It could be something as you know simple as finishing a new book, starting a new book. Um, anything like that, saving money, you know what I mean? Anything that will make you feel better and help you learn, guys. It's all about experience, right? 52 new, I've experienced a lot throughout this year, a lot more than I could imagine that I, that I could do by writing down and giving myself a visual of these new things that I've done. I look back on it now and I'm like, wow, that was, yeah, nine months ago I did that. That's awesome. Yeah, I, I probably wouldn't have done that if I didn't think about something new to try. So definitely give 52 New a try, guys. You will not be disappointed. I could highly assure you of that. With that being said, Stay Hungry merchandise is in stock as we speak. Hoodies, beanies, uh, baseball caps. I got regular t-shirts. Look at, look, at, look at these beanies. I love these beanies, guys. The hoodies I love, too. I absolutely love the logo. Old BEA merchandise as well is in stock, so... Definitely give me a give me a shout out, guys. Give me a shout out in the comment box below. Email me at vbells11 at gmail.com. Shoot me over a message, whatever. Hoodies are $25. Beanies, ball caps, t-shirts, $15. I make them very reasonably priced for you guys. On Instagram, Believe Excel Achieve. Facebook, Believe Excel Achieve. Look for me on both of them. And if you haven't already on this YouTube channel, please subscribe to this channel. It definitely helps the BEA family grow bigger and better so i appreciate all of your support and uh, i really really hope you guys are out there getting it and keep climbing guys stay hungry god bless